this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. You know, as a young boy, you come to a stadium like this, you play in a national final, and you will remember this for the rest of your life. You tell them to be brave, you tell them to work hard, leave nothing on the, you know, leave nothing on the pitch. Um, any little niggles they have, forget about them, and these are once in a lifetime opportunities. My stomach is churning with nerves, I'm so happy for them. It's a fantastic competition, I think, especially from the girls' point of view, to have over a thousand teams enter this competition, and now it comes down to so many with a final each day over two weeks. I think it's great, and the standard of football is brilliant as well. To get to the last two in the country, it's just amazing, and something they may never experience again. So the fact that we managed to get 15 boys and 200 fans here has just been amazing. Yeah, I think it's a great occasion for, for any young aspiring footballer really to play at a stadium like this and gives them a taste of what they can have. I think it's good, you know, good for the kids obviously it's the biggest cup in the country, you know, to, to get all the, the best kids to try and get them on a big stage and I think it's nice to be in a stadium like this. This is their final, you know, and this is once in a lifetime chance. I was so hard the first half, they were brilliant, really strong. I couldn't get any prouder. They've done really, really well. They've played um, really well all season, so hopefully they can pull it back. I think over the last few years they've been striving to get more girls playing football, and this is a perfect opportunity to, for girls in schools to play at this level and compete against other schools around the country. And I think to play in a stadium like this and with the English Skills Cup and with PlayStation, and I think it's fantastic. What PlayStation do, combined with the England Schools Football Association, it's, it's the best in the world. There is not an organisation anywhere in any other country you know, that puts on this level of uh, football opportunity for youngsters. They'll never ever forget it. We were the underdogs coming in, but we always believed we could win.